My name is Steve Green, and today and tonight we're going to talk about the ukulele and the blues. This is the first part, and a lot of blues, early blues, was based off of very simple melodies uh, and very simple chords. So first we're going to talk about melody, which is also the thing we'll uh, talk in a later section, how to improvise off of that. But first, the melody. Okay, now I'm going to play with the full melody here, and it was probably with a little chord accompaniment in the background. So, one, two, three, four. <laughs> Okay, that's the full melody. Now we'll go over the details. Okay, okay, now we're going to go over each part of the melody slowly and get those nuances. So here we go, it's third string. And I'm playing all this with my thumb for the moment. Bending on the second fret with my second finger. Bending away from me, then hitting string four up to the first string, third fret. And something I'm also doing there is a pull off. Okay, so I'm literally pulling, pulling off. I'm not playing it with this. I'm playing it with my second finger. Okay, now I'm also getting this wiggle. And what I'm doing is I'm having my thumb help me. I'm squeezing the neck a little bit here so I'm getting this wiggly motion. So it's, I'm wiggling here. Okay, so. Okay, now there I did a slide. Wiggle. Slide, sliding from the first fret. And this is all with my third finger. That's important at the moment. Third finger. Second finger. Wiggle. Slide. Wiggle. Slide and wiggle. Slide and wiggle. That could be a new dance. Okay. So try that right now. Okay, thank you. Okay, uh, one thing I just wanted to say too about the last portion there. Some of you may find it more comfortable to slide with your first finger or third finger. Down here you may find it more comfortable to do your first finger or second finger. Oh, both are okay. All right, so here we go, the second half of the melody. We're going way up here in fret 10, third finger.
fingers three, sorry, three, one, three, one. Okay. Then the second time I do it, same thing up here, but I do a pull off. So I'm bending a little bit and then coming away from the string. That's the pull-off, so to speak. And you can give a little wiggle there. So, so the, that whole phrase would be and then it uh, ends up with simple melody and it all works for a C7 chord. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to play uh, the beginning part again and you can play along with that melody, see if you can get the melody in full. And then we'll go on to the chords. Okay, now I'm going to play with the full melody here and it was probably with a little chord accompaniment in the background so one two three four Okay. Okay. Now, the chords, the chords to this whole blues. It's a C7 chord. All right? First finger. Don't worry if this is uh, seems way too simple. Things will get more and more complicated as the next sections ensue. That's the whole strum thing to this blues. You know, we were talking about uh, if we wanted to use this special effect You know, we, we were talking about whether or not we wanted to use this special effect. It was an extra $5,000 uh, to add to the video <clears throat> budget, but I, I really think it's well worth it. So, time and the thumb down, 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 down. Foot goes up, thumb goes up, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. Up, down, up, down, up. So whenever I'm doing anything with my thumb like this, think, whoa, yeah, whoa, yeah, whoa, yeah. Maybe we'll bring on the finger puppets. Okay, so the rhythm, using the down, up, thumb, down, up, foot down, foot up, is going to be... Right? Simple, simple, simple but can get more complicated. Now we got muffle. Down, up. So I'm doing a muffle on the down stroke. I'm muffling the strings. And then release. Muffle, release. Muffle, release. So that gives us a nice kind of... You can add different rhythms with that. Down. Muffle. Muffle. 
Anyway, we'll talk more and more about rhythms, but that's a pretty cool thing to do. Okay, ukulele fans, this wraps up part one of you, the blues and the ukulele. Or is it the other way around? Anyway, next we'll talk a lot more about chords, different chord inversions, and how to improvise off that simple melody.